Good morning everyone, this is another session on palmistry and in this video we will be discussing few more points. Now we started with the, uh, in one of the videos I explained you about the fish symbol and uh, it's something like this and the interesting point about the fish symbol is that the fish symbol generally indicates towards a success generally maybe uh, maybe uh, maybe a good family life and wealth can be expected out of it but the the important inference uh, another interesting uh, finding is that that whenever this uh, symbol is found the person should be more patient because uh, you're getting a lot of uh, uh, you know wealth or probably family life is going to be good it also indicates a bit of struggle it's a good sign in, in general but it can also mean that after a bit of struggle the person finally succeeds and gets wealth and recognition and you know uh, family satisfaction, all these kind of things will be more, but uh, after an element of <coughs> after an element of struggle. Also, uh, we understand that the V symbol. Okay, sometimes uh, the lines you can can you see the V symbol, right? V symbol, like line splitting into two parts, is sometimes referred to as the Vishnu symbol, and is considered good in most of the cases. And it also, in the same way, indicates that the person does get a bit of uh, a lot of success. Uh, or a bit of success whatever it is but again an element of struggle will be present so in both these symbols though the person attains success though the person finally achieves a lot of uh, wealth and things like that but they also can indicate a bit of uh, you know <coughs> a bit of uh, hindrance or a bit of struggle early on now if this line and this line this is uh, is known as the girdle of venus and this is the bow of intuition these both add to the sensitivity of the person and in general will make the person more and more sensitive now another interesting point and uh, uh, a point which can be slightly confusing is that when the structure of the hand contradicts the formation of the line for example we can have a square palm and we can have a headline which is bending down now a square palm a square palm generally uh, you know indicates that the person is more methodical more practical and things like that whereas a uh, uh, the headline which is going down or which is bending down would indicate that the person is more imaginative and more creative so you know you can see that contradiction and whenever this thing happens the person will have both the traits so the person will be uh, both uh, very logical and very, very creative but the dominance or the dominant part will be the uh, the structure of the palms the person will continue to be more uh, practical and methodical and 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 will and will also have a creative streak but uh, the preference or the order uh, will be that the person is more logical and then more imaginative and both the qualities will be present so you know when the structure of the palm is kind of straw, uh, square the the associated qualities are practicality and things like that and whenever the, we see the headline going down the person is tended to be more imaginative now another interesting point is now this long line we understand is the fate line and whenever we we see a line coming from the influence line and joining it we understand that some uh, external influence is coming and helping the person's fate uh, it can also indicate the marriage partner's line and whenever it joins it's considered good but sometimes we also see a line coming from the center of the palm and going and joining this line now <coughs> this line is also considered good and this can mean success because of some mechanical device or something like that maybe using a computer maybe using some camera maybe using something else okay so it can also mean success uh, due to some mechanical device or someone else whenever it's coming from the moon then it's the help of others and whenever it comes from inside the venus it is someone from the family who is helping the person improve his or her fate now <coughs> Uh, uh, I also wanted to talk about the influence line also remember that this influence line uh, uh, or this long line is referred to as the lifeline and whenever we see another line coming inside it this is referred to as the influence line and indicates the presence uh, of an influence and whenever you see lines going up from this line right like the we know that there are uh, offshoots from the lifeline which means success same way from the influence line if you see lines going up like this then that can mean that the uh, that the influence uh, see say the influence is your partner okay so this will indicate that the, your partner will have a lot of success so same way the indication on this line will definitely be indicating towards your partner's uh, health and your partner's life in general or it can be someone else uh, or some other influence it can be a father mother to associate it accordingly
okay now another uh, i wanted to ask few questions now if you have followed uh, followed my videos now what can this loop means okay at the center of the palm slightly towards the mount of moon directing upwards what is this uh, loop called and what can it uh, you know mean another point is what is this loop and what will this mean okay if you can answer this and that that would be great uh, apart from that this loop is known as the loop of luna and this is associated with people who are slightly more creative and uh, love nature okay so if you have this kind of loop it will it is found in very few people and uh, in many cases it is found in uh, people who are uh, who are lovers of nature who understands nature who understands the working of nature and they can be very intuitive as well so this small loop present here horizontally across on the mount of moon can indicate that now uh, another point is that whenever you have the plus or the cross symbol on the thumb it's not considered very good it can indicate some conflicts in the marriage it's not a very good sign to see a plus or a cross symbol on any way on the thumb it is also found that whenever uh, <coughs> the family ring is very dark this is referred to as the family ring whenever it is very dark it's not considered very good so hopefully you got few more points in this video and i would request you to answer uh, the questions as to what this loop is and what this loop is and in general if you can tell something more about this palm it would be great right thank you i am shutank into palmistry do check my channel for more thank you take care bye bye